it's honestly self-explanatory like i don't really have to say much i really don't like just look <laughs> Take one. Action. Welcome back to another video. My name is Kay and this is Crown Baller. First things first before we even get into this video, honey. Hit that red subscribe button down below if you're not doing so already. And join the team. Come sit on our bench. We would love to have you here, of course. Also, follow me on all of my social medias. They'll be on the screen. If not, they'll be in the description box <laughs> below. Y'all know how this goes. So without any further ado, let's get in to this video. So y'all, if y'all couldn't tell already, Your girl's feeling herself. And obviously I have reasons why. Like can we just take a single second, a few moments. It's honestly self-explanatory. Like I don't really have to say much. I really don't like just look. <laughs> As you guys seen by the intro, this is a 30 inch deep wave HD lace and it is a five by five lace closure. So this is my very first time working with a five by five lace closure and it's my very first time working with an HD closure. Before I even get into this video, I want to start off with the quotations in the air that I put because I watched a video earlier, a popular girl on YouTube, her name is All About Michi, and she was like explaining the difference between transparent lace and HD lace. And so pretty much, if you get an HD lace and you kind of like mess with the lace in the front and it pulls, that means your lace is HD lace. If you start to mess with it and it does not pull, that means it's transparent lace. So, I say that to say, because I know that you guys seen that before, pulling a little baby and baby wasn't pulling back. Like, she didn't have no give. She didn't really respond to the yank. So, that honestly made me a little bit nervous because I'm like, if you guys are promoting this wig to be HD and it's not like, make it make sense I need a couple of my dollars back because I paid for HD lace. I'm not sure if like I didn't pull hard enough or if that was an accurate test. I'm not really sure but I just wanted to say that because that was like one of my main concerns initially. Like will it be HD lace or will this be a fake? So I don't want to promote something or say this is something and it's not or y'all get the same thing that's supposed to be it and it's still not what it was said to be. Does that make sense? It was a lot of confusion in that sentence, but I know that y'all are following me. So I really do hope that this is HD lace. I hope that West Kiss wouldn't do that. And I'm not sure if I said where this hair was from and it is from West Kiss hair. I did not order this hair from the direct website. I actually ordered this hair from AliExpress. I don't know why I keep on shopping on AliExpress. I just feel like AliExpress, I can get it. I'm obviously overseas a lot. Ordering from AliExpress kind of just makes it easier to order to Europe versus from ordering from the actual site and I have to like deal with the shipping. But in my experience ordering directly from a website versus AliExpress, I get better quality from the website. I don't know if this is the case right now. I'm just speaking for like my past experiences. Anyway, back to this hair. See her, she's beautiful, she's gorgeous, that's me. <laughs> My birthday is this Saturday. Today is Monday. My birthday is this Saturday. Hopefully this video will be up before. It probably will be up after, honestly. But this is the hair that I am wearing to Miami. I do plan on giving her a little razzle dazzle, but that'll be in another video so you guys can check that out. Turn that post notification bell on so y'all know when I post new videos. Yeah, this is 30 inch magic honey and deep wave. Let me just... I pull it all the way down it comes 
all the way to my butt. When I say I'm in love with this hair, I did not do too much. Y'all know this ain't the channel for baby hair, so I literally just laid some hair down, literally. I'm not even gonna tell y'all nothing that's not real. I promise y'all right now. And this is just my initial, I only had, like I said, for a couple days, so who knows what could change when I start to touch it and do stuff to it in the long run. Hair is soft. It is literally tangle free. I literally just used this brush. I brushed it through for the very first time. Baby, it was going through like butter. Is this straight hair or deep wave? Cause I don't know. What's kiss? What's in the recipe? I need to know, I need to know. I'm in actual love. Like this is the, probably the easiest and quickest install I have done on a wig. Even the four, four by four closures, you know, like I have to do a lot more work and manipulation because it's not, HD lace. I did not bleach these knots. You guys can see my wig cap a little bit. I could have added more, a little bit more powder. I'm about to go to bed. So this is a quick little install. I'm definitely gonna make myself sideburns because I love a good sideburn moment. So with a closure, obviously you're not gonna get that lace to make sideburns. So I'm for sure gonna have my sideburns out. I just literally washed this hair and conditioned it and put it on my head. This is a super beginner friendly wig. I have to do a lot of manipulation unless you just want to. I barely plucked. I barely, 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 I'm talking about the bare minimum. I did get some shedding, but I did not brush the hair from after I plucked it. So that was the little bit of strands I believe that I plucked. I haven't received very many, but it was what I expected after I plucked it and didn't brush it. It's actually giving me curly, like this looks like curly hair, but it's supposed to be deep wave. I really don't even want to touch her. I'm thinking about putting a couple little, like I said, razzle dazzles in her for when I go to Miami this weekend, but I'm really don't even think I need to. Like, do I even need to? Like, cause she's fire how she is. Like, I did want to show you guys some of the products that I use. This is the Total Miracle 7-in-1 conditioner and it's a little revitalizing. It actually has ap apricot and macadamia oil in it. There's another one that I use that has avocado and jojoba oil in it. They all smell amazing. And I just love the way Aussie makes my hair feel super soft. And then I also have this scrunch mousse leave-in and curl hold. So it's a leave-in conditioner and it's a curl holder. It's a two-in-one. Come on, Aussie. We appreciate it. I was using this before with my curly hair, but I watched a video on Bronnie. I don't know if you guys know who that is. I put it in the cards above so you guys can see that video, but she loves this product. So I wanted to make sure when I got my deep wave hair, wanted my curls to look just like hers. So I wanted to get this and make that come to life. Yeah, y'all, I'm not gonna keep yapping. I just wanted to come and give y'all a quick little initial. You know, I'm gonna come back with some tea on this hair and let y'all know if she changed, if she stayed the same, or if we need to speak to a manager. Cause I'm quick to write a letter. But that is all for this video. Thank you guys so much. I'm definitely about to go flick it up and put on my bonnets and go to sleep. Definitely be on the lookout for an update and definitely be on the lookout for what I decide to do with her for my birthday. It should be some vlogs coming up for my birthday. Just turn your post notification bell on, girl. Like, so you know when I post videos, stop playing. Like, all the information for this wig also will be in the description box below and the link as well to this. I'm gonna find the link for AliExpress and for the regular site so you guys can check it out. Honestly, like I don't even, like I'm just lost for words. Like I just keep looking at myself in the mirror, in my camera. I just keep looking and like, there's just more and more joy that comes to my heart. Like, but I love you guys so much. I can't wait to see you in the next one. Give me a kiss. Mm -hmm.